My name is Craig Gibbs and I'm the assistant curator here at the Queen Zoo. We have three baby pronghorn antelope and uh, yeah, I would say they're extremely cute. The babies are Dugan Jr., who's the oldest, he's about five weeks, and then we have the twins, um, a male and a female that are about three weeks, and it's uh, JR and Mags. We get daily weights on them, um, and it's just a way that we can make sure that they are uh, doing what they're supposed to be doing, which at this point is mainly growing. And uh, so we, we, every day we, we put them on the scale and we have a record of how much they're gaining. Right now they are weighing about eight and 15 pounds. But the males will get to be about 150 pounds, and the females get about 120 pounds. Um, generally in captivity, pronghorns are hand reared, um, and that's a way that we can deal with them on exhibit and off exhibit in a way that is uh, safe for them and safe for the keepers. We had our senior supervisor, Donna Graff, who started with bottle raising them. So usually Donna gets here early in the morning, usually around 6, 6.30 for the morning feed, and then three more feeds throughout the day. So it's a, it's a very long day for our keeper staff. Just getting them to take one bottle is impressive. It's a testament to how uh, Donna is with them and how, how they kind of learn to trust her. And so, you know, pretty much where she goes, that's where they're gonna be found. When, as soon as they're born, they're pre prey for almost uh, anything out there, coyotes, wolves, mountain lions. And so they have to be able to either hide by laying really flat in the grass, or they need to be able to run very fast to escape their predators. Every day, I think we can say that we see them getting a little bit stronger and a little bit faster.